good day students today we are going to discuss regarding the important questions in degree first year physics the first year physics paper title is mechanics and oscillations okay this is the first sem uh, paper see in this in unit 1 the important questions for examination purpose are in vector analysis unit 1 is our vector analysis in vector analysis the important questions important long answers are we have to learn gradient of scalar field and its physical significance divergence divergence and curl of a vector field okay divergence and curl of a vector field and vector integration like line surface volume integrals for short answer okay for long answer stokes theorem gauss theorem green's theorem okay stokes theorem gauss theorem green's theorem so these are the important topics uh, for short answer scalar and what are scalar and vector fields okay for uh, and for short answers line in line surface and volume integrals what are line surface volume integrals okay again in for short answers you may ask what is divergence of a vector what is curl of a vector what is gradient of scalar field you may also ask for short answer okay so here uh, compulsory in first unit compulsory questions for long answer you have to read these three theorem three theorem stokes theorem gauss theorem and green's theorem gauss divergence theorem green's theorem these are the compulsory questions you have to read don't skip these three questions if, if you read these three questions compulsory one question will be frame in your examination okay frame your in examination so don't skip these three equations these are these three theorems stokes theorem gauss divergence theorem and Green's theorem next and if you want to learn more uh, concepts in first unit you can go for gradient of scalar field and its physical significance okay for long answer again divergence of a Diver, what is divergence of vector field and uh, obtain or state and uh, and uh, deduce that equation okay that is for long answer again curl of what is curl of a vector and deduce that equation so these are the totally we have six long long answer questions one is gradient of scalar field and physical significance you may ask and divergence and de uh, deduce the divergence of a vector field and curl of a vector deduce the curl of a vector field okay these are the three long answers and lastly again three questions are stokes theorem gauss divergence theorem and green's theorem these are the again three long answers so totally we have six long answers okay uh, in that okay you can learn all these six three, six uh, long answers are compulsory my suggestion is compulsory don't uh, uh, yes, or don't skip this questions stokes theorem in second unit in second unit mechanics uh, in second unit we have two topics mechanics of particles and mechanics of rigid body these are the two chapters in second unit okay in in second unit we have mechanics of particles and mechanics of rigid bodies so in in this second unit what we have to learn okay so the important questions are for long answers variable mass system motion of a rocket you can ask if variable mass system okay uh, f external is equal to f reaction like that there is a one question okay regarding this variable mass system and motion of a rocket is important okay and for short answers you may ask loss of motion newton first law second law third law right so uh, for short answer multi-stage rocket you can ask ma multi-stage rocket what is multi-stage rocket and uh, again for uh, short answer what is impact parameter scattering cross section like that okay these are the short answer questions okay uh, so my suggestion is you have to learn this variable mass system compulsory motion of rocket for long answer questions in first chapter uh, second unit first chapter mechanics of particles in mechanics of rigid bodies in the second chapter you go for 
this Euler's equations. Okay, Euler's equations, right? And uh, precision of top and gyroscope. These are the three important questions. If uh, if you want to learn, you can learn this inertial tensor. What is inertial tensor? Okay, so. Uh, in second unit for short answer what is rigid body definition of rigid body you can learn okay mm, like that uh, in in uh, second unit in mechanics of particles that is in first unit for short answers loss of motion that is newton first law second law third law and for long answer variable mass system motion of rocket okay again if you want to learn for long answer you can learn collusions in two and three dimensions okay it he uh, may ask uh, this uh, question for long answer also okay so my suggestion is if you want to learn uh, important questions from second unit compulsory questions gunshot question my suggestion my suggestion is you should don't skip this variable mass system and uh, motion of rocket okay and from second chapter don't skip euler's equations okay and precision of top uh, you may ask gyroscope for short answer or may you may ask for long answer okay uh, so at least you have to learn this variable mass system if you learn variable mass system it is easy to learn motion of rocket okay both are somewhat related and uh, in second chapter so second and second chapter compulsory questions are Euler's equation and precision of top gyroscope so entirely you should learn these things from second unit okay second unit is somewhat huge first unit is very uh, short okay whereas second and third units are somewhat huge and a fourth unit also okay so uh, in okay so next in third unit if you take third unit central forces in central forces uh, we have the central forces in which we have for long answer question we have to learn uh, what is central force and uh, definition and examples and uh, conservative nature of central forces okay you may ask that question or you you can directly go for this kepler's loss okay three kepler's loss and their derivation you may ask uh, what is kepler first law and derive derive the kepler's law okay or you may ask uh, directly three laws derive derive Kepler's loss like that. So Kepler loss are important. Okay, Kepler's loss are important. Compulsory. Uh, you may ask that question. Okay, what is Kepler law and deduce Kepler's first law like that? Okay, so Kepler's are Kepler's loss are important and uh, central forces and uh, what we can say conservative nature of central force is important. Uh, in special theory of relativity, long answer purpose question. Michelson Morley experiment mostly asked question okay and uh, you may ask Lorentz transformation for long answer and for short answer time dilation length contraction okay there are the for short answer question in uh, in this first uh, third unit first chapter you may ask for short answer what is central force and give some examples you may ask for short answer and uh, you can ask uh, what we can say Mm, what is gravitational potential like that for short answer gravitational field okay so you may ask for uh, short answer what are kepler's three laws for short answer also okay so sometimes so uh, in special theory of relativity the long answers are michelson morley experiment okay michelson morley experiment right and uh, So Michelson Morley experiment and what we have, what we can say, uh, Lorentz transformation and uh, that's it for long answer. For short answer, you may ask what are Galilean uh, transformations or uh, postulates of special theory of relativity and what are length contraction, time dilation. So for short answer question. So this is all about central forces. Next in fourth unit, if you see in fourth unit oscillations okay in fourth unit oscillations the important questions are what is simple harmonic oscillator and derive the solution differential equation what is the differential equation of central force
so in uh, in uh, oscillations in oscillations in fourth unit simple harmonic oscillator what is simple harmonic oscillator and solution of uh, solution of the differential equation okay uh, again the characters of simple harmonic motion okay and uh, the important question is what second one uh, you may ask combination of two mutually perpendicular simple harmonic motions combination this combination of two mutually perpendicular simple harmonic vibrations of same frequency and different frequencies and Lissajous figure may be asked for short answer and second long answer is damped harmonic oscillator and its solution okay damped harmonic oscillator right damped harmonic oscillator and solution and differential equation okay and uh, uh, you may ask second for long answer forced oscillator and its solution okay right so here in this simple harmonic oscillator solution and differential equation okay long answer and damped harmonic oscillator solution and differential equation okay and forced so like this the important questions in first year physics that is mechanics and oscillation in vector analysis compulsory compulsory you have to learn compulsory you have to learn these three theorems stokes theorem gauss theorem and uh, green's theorem okay so compulsory questions and in second unit compulsory questions you have to learn motion of rocket variable mass system okay and uh, in the second chapter Euler's equations precision of top gyroscope okay second and second chapter next next in central forces in central forces uh, you should learn compulsory questions are what what is central force and definition and example conservative nature of central force okay long answer question and der derivation of Kepler's laws three laws okay in special theory of relativity Michelson more lakes permit and uh, what we can say Lorentz transformations these are the two long answer questions okay so in say, in the third unit central forces conservative nature of central force k plus loss and if you want to learn my uh, more more uh, answers Michelson more lakes permit Lorentz transformations okay these are the important questions in third unit and in fourth unit simple harmonic oscillator okay damped harmonic oscillator and solution and forced oscillations okay so forced oscillator and its solution so these are the three important long answers in fourth unit right so like this uh, easily compulsory gunshot questions uh, in uh, mechanics and oscillations are for in first unit stokes theorem gas theorem green's theorem okay in second unit variable mass system motion of rocket okay euler's equation precision of top gyroscope uh, sent in central forces central forces conservative nature of central force k plus loss and michelson more lake experiment lorentz transformation in oscillations simple harmonic oscillator damped harmonic oscillator and forced oscillator so these are the important gunshot questions compulsory questions okay so don't skip these questions Okay, all the best. Thank you.